guys, welcome back to Kawaii Toy Collector and in today's video I'm going to show you guys how to make no glue microwave slime. So yeah, also guys the hashtag notification squad from my last week's video is... Also remember please leave a like and subscribe to Kawaii Toy Collector and in the comments down below give us some video ideas. So let's get right into the video. Okay guys, so in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to make microwave slime. So this recipe probably sounds really weird to some of you guys. It sounded weird to me too a couple weeks ago when I first started testing out this recipe. But this recipe is super cool and super easy. And I don't think many people have heard about this yet on YouTube. So I thought I would show you guys this recipe today. So the ingredients you guys will need to make microwave slime is... You will need any type of thick soap. I have this soft soap right here. This one is probably one of my favorite things to use to make no glue slime with. It's like the best. Then I also have this soft hand soap. And this one works very well too. Just any type of thick soap. Then you guys will also need a boiler plate to make your slime in, and I do recommend that your bowl is microwave safe. This will be super better, so like nothing like terrible happens to the bowl or melts or anything. You can just see that at the bottom of here at the bowl. And also I have a lid for it, so when I put it in the microwave, nothing will like go anywhere. <laughs> then you guys will also need a mixing tool. So I'm first going to get out my boiler plate, and I'm going to get adding in my soap. I'm going to be using the soft soap body wash right here. And I'm going to get adding it to the bowl. And this soap smells amazing. I love this soap. That looks like just enough. And for this recipe, it is a one ingredient slime recipe. You can add salt. I'll say that. I don't really like adding salt into my Nogu slime recipe. Just because I feel like it melts it down a little bit more. And it's not really needed. So I'm just going to keep it like this. And I'm going to get mixing it up now. thick already so I'm gonna stop mixing it there and now what I'm gonna do with this is I'm actually gonna put the lid on just like this and I'm going to put this into the microwave for about 10 to 15 seconds and make sure you have your parents like permission to do this because you don't want to use like any bowls that will get all messy and stuff so I'm gonna do that now and then in the next clip I'll show you guys me doing it Okay, so it just came out of the microwave and it is super, super hot. Just a little bit, not too hot, but just be careful with this. And, ooh, some bubbles formed on the top. And I can see it melted a little bit, which is good because I'm going to mix it more now. So after it's out of the microwave, you just want to mix it up even more. Because I've learned since testing this recipe that this actually makes a slime. <laughs> that is enough mixing. And now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put this into the refrigerator for about an hour or so. And every 30 minutes I'm going to take it out, mix it up, and see how it's doing. So I'll see you guys in about a second. Okay. Ooh, look at the backdrop. That looks really cool actually. But it's been about an hour and here it is. And I'm really excited to see it. And I don't know where my mixing tool went so I'm going to take it. Okay, I'm so sorry. My camera takes forever to focus. But here it is. And let's see how this is doing. And ooh, it kind of looks a little icy on the top. It's a little weird. And oh my goodness. This definitely thickened up, which is so cool. Yeah, this worked very well with the microwave. It still is very, very slimy like because it's not all the way done. Because I usually leave it in for like two hours, but I really wanted to get this video up for you guys. But you can tell it worked really well for using the microwave. It's just like a one ingredient no glue slime recipe, the, but the microwave made it much, much thicker as you can tell. Because a lot of the times my recipes are a little bit watered down and that's just because of the, the soap I use or just like how much, how long I put it in the fridge or something. But this one worked amazing and I really like this one a lot. I'm going to post all the results on my Instagram. So if you don't know my Instagram, it's down below because I'm actually going to put this in for another hour when I'm done with this. But yeah, but this recipe turned out amazing as you can tell. It just is a bit sticky, but that's fine. <laughs> Look how thick that is. That is crazy. But this recipe turned out great and I really hope you guys try it out. If you want to see more videos like these with the microwave slime, I can, I can even try other type of things like this. Put it in the comments down below. I love you guys so much. I will, I will be uploading more videos before Christmas comes. And yeah. So remember to please leave a like and subscribe to White Toy Collector. And in the comments down below, give us some video ideas. Bye guys. I love you so much. In peace and thumbs up for no clue slime recipes. Bye.